How to add music to Instagram story is the topic of today's video. If you're new to the True to Tucker channel, please go down below and hit the subscribe button. I really do appreciate it. And then go and leave a like. It really helps this video out and get to more people. So today I'm showing you how to go and add the music to your Instagram story. Now I know a lot of people have had issues of adding music to their story for many different reasons. Hopefully I'll be showing you a way for this which will work for you. I'm going over two different methods and definitely one of them should work for you. So I really, really hope that um, you can achieve your goal of adding the music to your story. So anyway, let's jump straight into this tutorial of this video. Now let's jump straight into this. As you can see, I'm now on my phone and the first thing we need to do is open up Instagram. Make sure you're logged into the account you want to make the story. So let's go and hop into Instagram right now. As you can see, this is my account. I currently have zero followers and zero following. This is just an example account to show you how to do certain things. Now, if you need to add another account, just quickly add the three lines and then click settings. And then you can scroll down and click add account and you can go and sign into other accounts um, if you need to. But anyway, let's jump straight into this. So the first method is simply by using the sort of, I guess, original feature of being able to go and add music to Instagram story. So to do that, we're going to do a swipe across just like so. And then you want to go and take a picture. So I'll just take a picture of my mouse map. As you can see, it's now taken the picture. And now it's this blank. So you can draw something as well, add any text you want, just like saying, um, example just like so they click done so then to go and add the music all you want to do is click on the sticker so after five it's the third one along so one two three click there and as you can see i've got music there but to find that you may need to search for music uh, it'll take a minute to load as you can see music stickers and it'll have the lines moving then you want to click on it just like so and then it's going to have for you which is normally like the most used songs recently so everyone's been using that one um the mood song and then you've got loads and loads by popular artists so you can go and search music by clicking search and searching for a specific song or you can go on browse and you can search for another song as well so you've got more um niches here as well so for music say if you wanted like an alan walker song Alan Walker you've got faded it's sort of like the classic song you probably heard on YouTube before so I'm gonna click on it there and then it's gonna come and load so as you can see this is part of the tutorial which you may be interested in you can go and change where which part of the song it plays you can have 15 seconds or you can change it so I'm gonna have 15 seconds but you can actually have this text so when you play it if we click play um, as you can see the the text will move but if you just want the static image, you can go there. And if you just want the image, you have this box with a little line to the right. And then you can have the little box with the line to the bottom. And it'll be like this, which, you know what? I quite like both, actually. So once you've got the bit of music you want, then you click done. And then you can move this round, change the angle of it, literally do anything with it you'd like. Uh, and you can change that by clicking on it. And you could change it to say this one or back to tech. So that's just how you want it personally. It's personal preference. And it will start playing when you publish it. And if I had my phone music on, you'd hear it as well. Now, I know some of you guys don't actually have the access to this feature it's not available on some accounts now to get around this i found an awesome app so come to the app store and simply search for something called InShot video editor this is a bit of a lengthy process but if you want music to your stories it's so so easy all you want to do is go and download it it's really easy to use it's only 80 megabytes as you can see and then you want to go and click open and essentially what this allows you to do is allows you to add music to your videos so once you're here to go and start then you want to click video and you can go and click blank for example um, and I'll take a minute to load and then click tick and then all you want to do is you can add all of these features down here So there will be a little ad But as you can see if this is the video of yours you say taken and you want to upload to your Instagram story Then all you want to do is click on music and you can go and add tracks So then you click add tracks and you can use music from iTunes You've got featured here as well and you've got effects So if, say if I wanted from from iTunes we can click on there You'll need to have it in your library So I'm gonna click don't allow for now and then you can go and import music as well by using your files or airdrop And there are so many options for this You can then go and add them and use them on your Instagram story You then just click tick when you read the music and then you can go and click on the square with the line uh, click up here and then you can go and click save and then it's gonna save it to your camera roll and you can go and upload that to your Instagram story. I hope you have found this video useful. If you have, make sure you leave a big fat like and subscribe for more content just like this. More daily videos coming very soon. Have an awesome day. Peace out.